but it takes a man to stand up and be courageous to truly love his his lord god and his country to love his creator and his his neighbor and stand up for what is right stand up for righteousness and truth for irish values as they once were now i know this country has gone through a lot of evil from the catholic church i know that people have suffered under the catholic church regime it's nothing more than a cult designed to smear as a smear campaign against jesus christ and against christianity to get christianity a bad rep that's all it ever was supposed to do and to be a mockery of the true faith It has been used as a number of different things to exact a number of different agendas over the years. But it's basically a smear campaign. And so people have this hatred towards the Catholic Church, towards Christianity. But the mistake they're making is that they're hating Christianity when Catholicism doesn't represent Christianity. Catholicism doesn't re represent Christ. It represents Satan. It represents the Antichrist. It doesn't adhere to the Holy Bible. It doesn't adhere to the commands of God. So I'm here today to educate you on the truth that the Catholic Church does not have its roots in Christianity. It has its roots in paganism, pan pantheism. It doesn't have its roots in Christianity. just because you have a Bible doesn't mean you're a Christian just because you wear a chain with a cross on it doesn't make you Christian you see paganism is long since established praise the Lord it's long the Catholic Church has, has been long established as a smear campaign praise the Lord so there's hope and a future in Jesus Christ. If you would look to Jesus Christ and to true Christianity instead of false churches that misrepresent Christ, then you would have salvation.